Do you care to repeat what you just said, Laura? She was like, oh, how am I going to enter this video? Oh, hi, welcome to my shop. Today I brought this fine woodworking expert. <laughs> just kidding. It's just Simone. It's just Simone. <laughs> Don't get excited. <laughs> so I found this mirror in the house, in the big house. I, this is Felix. <laughs> And what I need in the little house, this is an interesting video. I need a little bit of a mirror cabinet. So I thought, let's just use this, by the way. Because <laughs> contrary to popular belief, Laura does look at it. <laughs> One might not think, but I do <laughs> look in the mirror every once in a while. <laughs> So how do you envision this mirror cabinet to work and look? I thought this would be a straightforward video. Yep. A project, just like a cabinet, something behind the mirror, like my toothbrush. And it should have some light. So light, storage, mirror, sliding, or just like opening mechanism. So you're just thinking like a basic bitch Ikea cabinet? Yes, that's my dream. There's nothing fun about it? Self-assembly. I mean, I think there could be something fun about it. Like what? Like neon light, I think that's fun. So just, mm. and then, you know, just a cabinet like this, the and then you thing. can slide to the side. <laughs> this lamp is from Lisa Lotte. Oh, really? Isn't that crazy? Like OG. OG. Wow. Welcome. Yeah, I am so happy here. Yeah. Oh, I mean, what, what else do you need? Are you gonna put cushions here? Yeah, usually Smudo has his bed here. Yeah. So he sleeps here. And I think this is where the cabinet should go. This can be somewhere else. I just put it here temporarily because there is also power. power. Yeah. So and this is, this is like the double opening thing. Oh, nice. That's why I was thinking maybe to make it sliding because it's, so it's not the same yeah. thing. So cabinet here, mm -hmm. slide it to the left. Yes. Oh, and maybe to your point, maybe it could have a little shelf underneath mm. with like stuff. Okay, so I think maybe we should look for a neon light, look for wood mm -hmm. that we want to work with, look for a handle, mm -hmm. and then we can design once we have all the stuff together. Yeah. Maybe we should. This is the Laura way. That's the Laura way. <laughs> Scurry things together. <laughs> like, this one goes here, this one goes here, this one goes here. I like red just because it's like very, very comfy light. Yeah. <laughs> is that going to be red? Yeah, the but this is red too. I mean, this is this is red too. This is so fun though. Yeah. It could be coming out on top. Yeah. Right, so we gathered most of the materials and the first step is to glue the mirror mm -hmm. on a backing and then we can add stuff to the backing. Is that enough? Yeah. Ah. Okay, and then we just clamp it like this. <laughs> <laughs> because we also don't want to like yeah. stress the material too much. So for the building material of the cabinet, I want to use the last pieces of the floorboards from Lisa Little. Um, the only problem is they have these profiles on the inside. So I thought about covering this maybe with aluminum. But, but then Simone had the great <laughs> idea. <laughs> but then Simone had the great idea to cut little wooden strips and just insert it. So it gives this funky look. Yeah, it's, so you know, let's make you, it way more complex. Where do than your it needs ideas come from? Like how?
Good job. Such a good idea. I'm just excited to sand it and put oil on it. Because mm -hmm. I feel like that will really make it pop in a different way. Yeah. It, so, is, very, it is very busy. Yeah. I okay. love the idea. You don't have to love it. I do, though. <laughs> no, I love it and it's very busy. <laughs> Great. Cool. Yeah. So this is all dried, mm -hmm. sanded, mm -hmm. looks great. Mm -hmm. Next decision is, is this the outside or the inside? I stand outside. You stand outside. I think inside? Yeah, I know you're going to go with inside. But anyway, we're going to put oil on it and see how it pops. Oh, there's like no difference. <laughs> the board is very curved, so we need to figure out how to scare it straight. <laughs> Problem is my planer is not working. It could be both. Yeah. I think we can force it. This is actually the first time in my life that I'm doing a dry fit. Oh my God, it's so off. <laughs> oh, this is the first time I've done a dry fit. <laughs> you know, we forgot Shouldn't to Shouldn't have done the dry fit. fit. Cause now the neon doesn't. <laughs> Wait. No, it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe the mirror is diagonal. Yeah, that's great. I love it. I understand that you're being sarcastic. I cannot believe we did that. Rewind. What happened? We want to build this mirror cabinet. We go out and look for things, features, materials we want to use. We select the neon, the slides, and the handles. None of them work. <laughs> <laughs> then we spend about three hours to make this visual feature of the inserted hardwood into the floorboards. We turn them to the inside because we don't like it. I don't like it. So what we have is an ugly ass mirror frame for a mirror that, by the way, I did not notice is super fucked up. Did you see all the stains it has? No. <laughs> Where is it? It's Where is over it? here. Can you see it on camera? I think we call it a day mm -hmm. and we get back to it tomorrow. I want to say one thing. Up until the last 10 minutes of today, the fun is the same, whether you build something that's a success or a failure. Know what I mean? I, I hope in your No, side. yeah, no. It's like... <laughs> Silence. <laughs> no, it's okay. Yeah, and let's I... call it a day. Let's start fresh tomorrow. Yeah. We have a plan. Problem number one is that Laura didn't really like these planks that we poured a bunch of time and love into. And also they're a little bit warped and yeah. the box kind of just became a bit wonky. So we're not doing that. We're rebuilding the box around it in plywood. Yeah, second problem was that the neon didn't fit because we kind of forgot to measure the neon. It just built the box. <laughs> um, and then Simone had the great idea to have the neon be half inside, half outside. So I found this U which would be perfect upside down to have this come out on top, 
you still have it as a light, but if you open the cabinet, there's still light inside. I think it's a great idea. I think we should do it. One, two, three, quick build montage, then we're happy, then we celebrate. One, two, three. things so we need to figure out how to mount the tracks without having the mirror come out from yeah. the cabinet in the back i thought we just cut a recess so we glue them onto a, uh, like we screw them onto a piece of plywood and then we just recess them like this yeah and then we mount it well hold on all of this needs to be recessed yes yes yeah. yes, yes i yeah. think maybe first thing we do is figure out how to mount the neon lights and then we yeah do the other things off of that Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. Okay. <laughs> Oof. I do like it. Yeah? Yes. Well, that's great news. The client is happy. Also, we should test it with it standing up. I mean, it looks it looks good. Well, that's good. Yeah. Okay, now it's just electronics. What could possibly go wrong? Ready? Why are you laughing like this? I guess it looks so much like a shot. <laughs> it does. <laughs> it is a sign, like you should have bought a mirror. <laughs> you should have just bought one. I just picked Simone up from the airport. <laughs> Let me just put some things in my shopping bag. <laughs> this is, I know what this is, hold on. This is an art installation, and this is consumer criticism. Look at yourself. Oh. 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 Look at all the oh. things you're buying. Oh. Oh, you, you know what we should have checked? No. If it works. Oh, yeah! Ah. Okay, okay, okay. I mean, I think I, like, I have to see it at night because I really want to know. I think that's nice. Yeah. I don't know how you feel about it, but I think it looks way better in here than in the shop. Yeah? I think, yeah. I mean, especially when the light is not on, it doesn't look like a shopping bag at all. It just looks like a mirror cabinet. You stop mm -hmm. laughing right no, now. No, 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 I'm not laughing. <laughs> and I, I think, I mean, it is functional. It is what I wanted it to be. I do regret a little bit working with this mirror that I found because now in daylight, you see how dirty, 
not dirty but broken it is there are like mm -hmm. stains in it and it just looks dirty but i will go to bed every night and think about the fun we had and what an amazing project this was it's just like a like it was just success after success mm -hmm. everything Amen. went right friendship it's like flow when you're in the flow zone mm -hmm. with your best friend building stuff yeah there's nothing like it not even a mirror that looks like a shopping bag <laughs> flow and no fail right that's it we have at least one of those things <laughs> flow because i just got my period <laughs>